King Kridrevskoy, the mighty ruler of the Netherworld. His long reign came to an abrupt end as the news of his death spread throughout the Dark Land. Ambitious demons rose one after another to seize the opportunity. And thus began the age of turbulence and anarchy. Two years later,
get the prints for you, dude! Would he normally die from that? The Overlord's son should be able to deflect a couple hundred rounds, no problem. Master Edna! You don't look very happy, dude! What are you talking about? I'm glad that Brett's finally dead. In fact, I've never been happier. I bet, dude! He'd boss us around, but he couldn't even figure out how to send to VCR! The fan is stamping! My food is bland! His complaining sure was annoying, dude! It's his own fault for being betrayed by Master Etna, dude! Yep, it's his fault for dying so easily. But this isn't good. What's the problem, dude? Mission accomplished, right? But that is the problem. Think about it. With the prince gone, he's got no use for me. I just know he's gonna betray me. You're too cynical, dude. I think you're gonna get a huge reward. Don't be stupid. That'll never happen. Why not? You did your job, dude! Because if I was him, I'd betray him as me! You demons are evil, dude! But the prince is dead, dude! Won't he find out eventually? I suppose... Oh, I know! <laughs> you there, you cute little creamy! Come over here! knows the prince is still alive. <laughs> but won't that make more demons try to kill us, dude? Don't worry. Our mighty Prince Laharl here will crush those fools. But what about demon lords? We can't beat them, dude. Ooh, they'll make perfect examples to show off the prince's power. In fact, I don't even want to wait for those demons to show up. That could be me next. I hope Prince Laharl is up to it, dude! Well, let's just go back to the castle and celebrate the prince's return! Alright, dude! Ah, oh, my back! I can't believe no one's noticed what's going on, dude! Everybody always 
always hated the prince, so maybe they just don't care. <gasps> Joking. You don't know how much I spent to keep their traps shut. I didn't even notice you were bribing everybody, dude! Oh, and by the way, I paid everybody with your paycheck. You're evil, dude! Reporting in, Master Edna! A new demon named Fires is rapidly gaining popularity, dude! Many demons are joining forces with him, dude! Never heard of him. Leave him be. He's probably just a nobody. He's after the throne! We gotta deal with him eventually, dude! Ugh! This Overlord business is such a pain in the ass! If you don't take him out, he might eat all that pudding from the Sea of Gehenna that you've been hiding in the fridge, dude! What? Ooh, if anyone touches my snacks, they're dead! Wait, how do you know about my stash? I'm just saying what if, dude! I don't know anything about it! Fine. So, where can we find this demon? Just ask the gatekeeper to take you to Byer's castle, dude! Well, Prince, it's time to strut your stuff! What are you waiting for? Let's go already! Good God, dude! <laughs> He sure is living in a nice place, prick. 
Be careful, dude! We came through the main entrance and no one's appeared yet! You're right. It almost seems like he's... Not home? So, you made me come all this way for nothing? That's it! I've gotta... break something! Dude, he should be here! I've done the research, dude! Right now, Fire should be staring into his mirror, asking who's the most adonic of them all, dude! Ah, oh, what a freak! Yeah, he was voted most likely to earn a degrading name in the Pretty Times, dude! So, he's in his room. I've done the research, dude! Alright, you know what to do. Standard Pretty looting formation! Let's move it! Roger that, dude!
the last room, take everything that's valuable. <laughs> Master Etna, did you hear that? <laughs> What? You're just hearing things. <laughs> He's choking, dude! How rude! You should never ignore a gentleman. What is it now? Kind of busy here? That is hardly a proper reaction after pilfering moi's treasure. But I give you credit for your bravery. Ha 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 ha! My name is Byers. I am the lord of this castle. Finally! So you're Byers. <gasps> what is it now, you freak? I cannot help it. It seems when people call moi that name, I get this overwhelming sensation. Oh, it brings such tears to my eyes. Looks like the rumors were right. You are a freak. My dear, I am an aristocrat blessed with beauty and power. They call moi the Dark Adonis. Now, mademoiselle, you are no ordinary thief. In moi, right? Yeah, well, you're no ordinary spaz. I admit it. I came here to eliminate you. Ah, I see. But, mademoiselle, you cannot defeat moi. Yeah, that's what they all say. But too bad for you, I'm not your opponent today. <laughs> then who wishes to face moi? Beg for mercy! You face the son of King Krachevskoy, Prince Laharl! Um, <laughs> nice to meet you! I'm Prince Laharl, dude! <laughs> Your attempts at humor don't go over well with nobles, such as Marcel. You think this is a joke? What's the problem? I'm Prince Laharl, dude! You, sir, are a pretty. You idiot! Look closer! Don't you see the antenna? <laughs> Well, Laharl did have those. See? That proves he's the prince. You would have moi believe he is the prince simply because he has antennae? What more could you possibly want? Laharl is Krachevskoy's son, is he not? Shouldn't he have something more? His father's noble and sparkling good looks, for example? Yeah, right. If he was anything like his father, I wouldn't have killed him. Huh? Oh, God. Uh. Anyways, this is the prince. It doesn't matter what you say. Wait. W what happened to, uh... Ugh! Master Edna, this ain't gonna work, dude!
He is the prince. I see. Beautiful mademoiselle, does your conscience not ache? Nope, not at all. Yeah, dude! Nothing can hurt Master Edna's dark conscience! <laughs> Why should I feel bad about defeating you anyway? That is not what I meant. Do you have no regard for the wishes of your master? Have you no loyalties to anyone? Hey, you're a demon too. Betrayal is a part of what we do. Besides, I pledged my loyalty to King Krichevskoy, not the prince. Do you believe King Krichevskoy would be proud of you were he standing before you now? What? King Krichevskoy is dead. Hmm? Now I'm gonna decide how I'm gonna live my life. I'm sure King Krichevskoy would understand. Let's go, pretties! Looks like we've had a change of plans. What will he do now? Yes, he just woke up, but his powers are still there. In fact, he just crushed the new up-and-coming demon by brute force. I see. But still, how did he survive after drinking that potion? And he has gained so much power. This is not good. Don't worry about it. Leave everything to me and the crown will be yours. Are you certain? Of course. Just remember. I know. When I reign as the Overlord, I will give you what you want. <laughs> it's time for Etna's Q&A Corner! This isn't the next episode preview! I'm taking this time out of my busy schedule to answer all your letters! This has gotta be a scam, dude! Let's check out the first letter. It's from a seven-year-old boy from Earth. Now let's see... Help me! I'm always being picked on at school! Sounds pretty serious, dude! Are you sure you can handle it? Please, they're little kids! I can massacre her like a billion little bullies. Wow, dude! Master Edna, you're willing to help him out? Sure! And I'll do it for the amazingly low price of 500 million health. What? No kid can afford that, dude! All they have to do is ask their mom or dad. But no one has that kind of dough, dude! in a charity here. So you're not gonna do anything? You're horrible, dude! Fine, he doesn't have to pay now. After he dies and becomes a printy, I'll just make him work it off. Don't do it, dude! 20-hour work pays your hell! Run away while you still can, dude! If you really want my help, send me another letter. You don't even get paid! Dude! 
bet she doesn't look happy! I think she met with that demon! Not even Master Etna could disobey him, dude! Anywho, I envy him for being able to command Master Etna, dude! Is he blackmailing her or what, dude? What can someone possibly have to blackmail her with, dude? Maybe... Master Etna's just a spy from an alternate netherworld, dude! You got it all wrong! She's definitely a spy from the future, dude! No, no, no! She's a space detective! Here to protect the peace, dude! Space detective? Did somebody here just mention a space detective? Who's that, dude? I don't know, dude! Please forgive me. My name is Flan, and I came from Celestia. It's a pleasure to meet you.
fine, whatever. Please teach the evil demons a lesson for the peace of the netherworld. Don't worry, I won't tell anybody that you're a space detective. as a whole. That's not changing the strategy at all, dude!
Look at that, dude! Is this... King Krachevskoy's portrait? What's it doing here, dude? Don't you remember anything? This painting was stolen from the castle. After King Krachevskoy passed away, the painting disappeared. I never knew it was here. Are you sure, dude? Couldn't it be a fake? On the back, there's a note that says, it's mine, so it's got to be real. You were going to steal it, dude! What are you doing? Hurry up and carry the painting to my room. Roger that, dude! I thought a rich demon was living here, but it turns out it's just some crook. I was going to kill him quickly, but I've changed my mind. He's going to have to suffer. Come on, let's hurry up and find the owner of this place. Aye, aye, dude! King Krachevskoy, no matter what happens, my loyalty is always with you. If you were still around, I wonder what you'd say to me. are getting numb. No! I can't give up now! This must be one of Miss Edna's tests! A space detective has to be able to overcome this! Now that I think about it, assistants don't get to transform and fight! But transforming is the What are you talking about? Are you saying that I, God, am 
am lying to you? No, but... Edna is the demon who is bringing this world into chaos. As God, I command you to eliminate this Edna. Okay. What are you doing? Now go! <laughs> what an idiot. That demon girl can't possibly be the Overlord. If Flan dies, all will be fine. And if by chance Flan does succeed, I can report to the Seraph that Flan has disobeyed his orders. Which means, the mission to eliminate the Overlord will fall to... me! Once I succeed, I will be one step closer to becoming the next Seraph!
for... <laughs> oh, money, how do I love thee? Let me count the ways. With you to fund my military campaign, I shall become the next overlord. Now I get it. This ugly castle belongs to Hog Miser. met a few times. I'm surprised you remember me. What? I'll never forget! Before the Overlord died, you went on a shopping spree using my credit card! Because of you, I almost went bankrupt! Really? That's funny. I don't remember. You dare to around with me? I'll make you pay for what you've done! That's nice, but you might want to check this out first. You have more troops? <laughs> <laughs> It's Prince Laharl! Yeah! We have the Overlord's son on our side! This guy's an idiot! Now that you know, you better obey us! <laughs> What's so funny? Has your fear driven you insane? Why should I obey him? Actually, I'm glad he's here. Once I defeat him, I'll be the next overlord! I'll squish him like a bug! Huh? You sure sound confident. Defeating you will teach anyone who opposes the prince a lesson. For the sake of the prince, have a spectacular death! Just when I finally found you! You're fighting for power and money! Is Miss Edna really the overlord like God said? That's true!
You sure don't have a lot of power to back up your big mouth. All right, Prinny Squad! Steal everything that looks valuable! You... You can't! I won't be able to survive without my money! This might not be the best time to tell you this, but I really don't care whether you starve to death or not. Violence doesn't resolve anything! 
Well, getting into arguments is pretty normal for friends, so they should be fine. You didn't help at all! Okay then, I'll be waiting for more of your letters! Goodbye! <sighs> Nothing gets settled around here, does it? some spicy volcano soup. Master Etna! That angel is gone, dude! <gasps> Who cares? That was kind of the point. Man, I want that soup. Hey, pretty! Whip some up! You got three minutes! But that's impossible, dude! Fine. I'll give you one whole minute then. You go to the Sea of Gehenna and steal the ingredients! That place is burning hot! And there's a lot of powerful monsters, dude! So? <laughs> That's why I've been asking to have leftovers for breakfast, dude! I said I want some spicy volcano soup! That scorching magma flavor has a divine aroma! your hunger and every time you bite into the ground human soul the flavor just bursts in your mouth and the collaboration between the exotic monster meat and the magma spices is well, simply put the ultimate combo that's what makes volcano soup the best and I need some right now that's it I've decided we're going to the Sea of Gehenna! Ugh, volcano soup is calling for me! Finale! Chronicles of Etnarnia!
trick!
it's so freaking hot! We should just give up and go back, dude! Are you nuts? We can't go back now! I won't risk my life for soup, dude! You lame brain! Do you really think we came all this way just to get soup? Wouldn't be the first time, dude! So what's your secret plan? It wouldn't be a secret if I told ya! Just shut up and obey my orders! I just might treat you guys to some soup if you do! You're really cheap, dude! Anyways, let's hurry up and find what we're looking for! If I remember right, it should be hidden somewhere around here. Mm. 
諦め
What's wrong? I thought you were going to teach me a lesson. Didn't you realize that I lost on purpose? Huh? And why would you do that? In situations like this, heroes need to be in trouble. So that they can overcome the odds and be victorious in the end. Uh, are you okay? Did you hit your head or something? No, but since I might really lose, I must retreat for now. Stupidity's gonna power up, that's for sure. I was waiting for you, Miss Etna! Here you are again! I'm going to win this time! Because I have powered up! Watch closely now, okay? That's it? So your eyes are glowing? Yes! Now I can see in the dark! Anyone who'd walk around at night wearing that mask has got to be some kind of crazy. You don't have to be jealous just because you can't do this. Oh no, she's completely delusional. You are, Edna. Demons like you are so simple. I knew you would betray me. I'll show you what happens to those who rebel against my authority. Enough for now. 
Next time we meet, I'll show you my true form. Take care. How much longer do I have to deal with this? I need to find it before Madeiras finds out. Now, where did he hide it? She's not a pushover for an angel trainee. I'll give you a secret item to aid you in your quest. What is this? It's a magic tome. With it, no demon, not even Etna, can rival your power. Now, Flan, you must defeat Etna before she plunges the netherworld into utter chaos. about. 
think, uh, anyways, I can finally get my memories back. Hey, where'd it go? Mm. <laughs> What are you doing? Well, um... <laughs> Looking for this, perhaps? into trying to kill me! What do you mean? Don't even think about it! Hm. Fine! Your plan was to claim that Lahari was still alive, so you could get your memory back while I fought him, was it not? Fool! I already know that you killed Lahari! Overlord and his son no longer exist. What? The Overlord is already dead? Why are you so surprised? God told me that you were the Overlord. Well, I was going to be the Overlord, but that's not the case anymore. You did a fine job, Edna. You've done everything I asked. Which means I have no reason to keep you around. What? Give me back my memory! <laughs> we are demons. Why should I show any sympathy for you? You shall regret trying to betray me! I'm gonna kill you if you do anything to my memory! What am I feeling? Ha! You're not even a noble demon! What are you doing here? Ha! What are you looking at? Step aside, commoner! for something so weak. I mean, you're eating my food, too. I don't have any more food. If you want more, you'll have to steal some on your own. I'm going now. Bye-bye. Was that... My memory? My, my! Looks like you could use a hand. Huh? Who is it? You! How disgusting! A noble demon should never harm a beautiful maiden. Let moi, the dark Adonis Myers, take care of this. Jeez, you got some crazy fetish or something? It's time for Flan's Q&A Corner! Where I, Flan, will answer everybody's letters instead of Miss Edna. <laughs> I've always wanted to do this. Here's the first letter, dude! It's from a girl living in the Netherworld. Took my fun away. What should I do? Hmm. That is a tough question. I don't understand how someone can just take people's fun away. It seems like the Netherworld is so full of these sad, evil people. It's so different from Celestia. You just need to teach those evil people a lesson about justice. You feel that way too, Flan? Yes! Angels are allowed to get mad too! I'm glad to 
hear it. Oh, hey! When did you get here? Why are you trying to take my fun away? <laughs> you look awfully scary, Miss Edna. Well, like you said... See tomorrow! Please calm down! You tried to destroy the lovely lady's memories, thinking they were worthless. But if you did that, she would never let you get away with it. Yep! If you don't want to die, then don't piss me off! Hm. What can she do? I'll just destroy her and not have to worry about it. I see that both of you are willing to settle this through battle. How about we return here another day to settle your duel? Huh? Why should I agree to that? I just want my memories back. If you fight Madeiras now, you won't walk away unscathed. You exerted plenty of your energy during your previous battle. Enjoying this, aren't you? The duel will be held three days from now. We shall all meet at Grand North, several miles north of Madaris's castle. If Etna should win, Madaris must return her memories. But if she should lose, hmm. How about uh, Madaris will become the next overlord? I will not agree. What guarantee do I have that I will become the Overlord by defeating her? There are plenty of others who are vying for that title. That is a good point. However, she did eliminate the Prince, the rightful heir to the throne. I am confident that you would qualify as the Overlord should you defeat her. And I will also give you this for defeating the young mademoiselle. The demon tome? Hey, why do you have that? I, uh, uh <laughs> I stumbled upon it earlier. Yeah. I think God has rewarded moi for being so handsome. Miss Edna, why is everyone so surprised? That book is beyond priceless. The Demon Tome can only be held by the Overlord himself. It's proof of being from the royal family. If you have that book, you're basically the Overlord. Wow! I never knew it was that easy to become an Overlord! <laughs> Fool! Why should I wait? I could just kill you all now! I understand how you feel, but I won't give this up that easily. If you attack, I won't hesitate to toss it into the lava! Have you gone mad? It can make you the Overlord! 
You think I'm joking? Huh? Go ahead. Go ahead and attack me. Ah. Very well. I will adhere to your plan. By the way, why did that buyer's guy say he was going to give up the demon tone? I don't think he had a choice in that situation. That's what I don't get. If he has the book, why doesn't he make himself the overlord? It's because of love! Huh? Sacrificing yourself for the well-being of others. It's a wonderful act of love. Demons don't care about love. I know he has something up his sleeve. But I'll play along for now. I need to get rid of Madeiras first. Pretty Squad, are you ready?
money, dude! Yeah, dude! Getting money for doing nothing is great! And Master Maderos pays us every day! So there's nothing to complain about, dude! Have you heard? Working for Etna's like being a slave, dude! She demands 20-hour work days, dude! And she only pays when she feels like it! She's ruthless, dude! Who does she think she is? I kind of want to go out and defeat Etna myself, dude! I'd love to shut her up for good! Us Dark Durians are invincible, dude! You guys sure talk big. Huh? Dude! You're gonna beat me, huh? Don't make me laugh. Even if you were joking around, I'm still gonna kill you! But dude, the duel's not till tomorrow! Who can wait that long? This doesn't look good, dude! Don't worry! We have a powerful ally, dude! Please help us, blessed lady, dude! Finally, some action! All this waiting was tiresome! Who's this weirdo? Miss Antoine! Please defeat Edna, dude! I was supposed to face a renowned opponent. This is indeed a disappointment. Who is this meager valley girl? Surely this is some sort of jest. Meager? You're about to find out how not all that you are, dude! Miss Antoine is a professional assassin from the Noble Demon class, dude! She enjoys her victim's death cries, dude! Miss Antoine, please use your magnificent super move on Etna! <laughs> Don't die on me too quickly. I wish to enjoy this battle as long as I can. I don't have time to waste on you. I better make this quick. Your confidence. I shall truly enjoy this. Are you ready? My attacks shall deliver a sweet death.
けらめうん One wish. By these frenies. Why do why? You got yourself a deal. They're striking a deal without us, dude. You better obey your new master. Uh, master Edna. <laughs>
What? You look pretty serious. That's not like you at all. Mr. Vyers mentioned that you killed the Overlord's son. Is that true? Oh, that. Yeah, I killed him. Why do you care? So it wasn't a lie. Why would he lie? Why? Why did you have to kill him? What's it to you? To tell you the truth, I was sent from Celestia to assassinate the Overlord. But I can't kill people without a good reason, even if the Seraph commands it. That's why I need to know. Why did you kill him? Are you dense? Why are you telling me your secret mission? Miss Edna, please answer my question. He may have been the Overlord's son, but he was such a selfish little brat. So, I shot him with my gun. I guess they're pretty lethal. I'm glad he's dead. You killed him because you didn't like him? Yep. But what if he liked you? <laughs> yeah, right. That would never happen, even if heaven and hell collided. That kid hated love and friendship more than anything. How sad. Angels are so weird. There's no point in feeling bad for someone who's already dead. No, I'm sad for you, Miss Etna. What? Why? You don't have to pretend. I know you didn't mean to kill him, and now you're starting to regret it. Yeah, right. I feel great. Why are you denying the truth? Even if you feel no remorse, you should openly express your feelings. However I feel, the prince is still dead. So stop bringing him up. I don't want to think about that brat. The Overlord must be sad too. Who knows? There's no going back, no matter what we do. I see. He sent the perfect candidate. She should be able to bridge the gap between Celestia and the Netherworld.
Master Lamington, are you here? Calm down, Volcanus. You're beginning to scare the spirits. Who cares about the spirits? I have received a report on Flan's activities in the Netherworld. Flan has failed to assassinate the Overlord and... She's become friendly with the demons. Assassinating an overlord is a much too difficult assignment for an angel trainee. Let me carry out this mission. Volcanus, tell me, when were you appointed god? W -w -w what are you talking about? Uh, I am here to serve my purpose as an archangel. Did you think I wouldn't know? I cannot accept this state of affairs! Everything is proceeding as scheduled. I have every faith in Flan to fulfill her duties. Her idealism shall hold firm.
should be around here somewhere. That wuss, where's he hiding? As long as my memories are safe, I don't really care. Hey, this feeling... Why? Why did you kill him? Tried to get into the food storage. It's his own fault. I had no choice. Come on, let's go. Why did you? You were so weak. Idiot. Ah, so here you are. How are you doing? Are you getting used to your new home? Huh. Is something wrong? It's nothing. It's just some noble demon killed this dog. But it's okay. I won't go hungry anymore. Kinda glad. You should be true to your heart. You're sad, aren't you? Huh? You don't have to pretend to be strong. to dig a grave for it. <laughs> Am I? Yes. You're not like other demons. And inviting a commoner like me to stay at the Overlord's castle is unheard of. Do you believe that nobles should reign over everyone else? Does being a noble, or a commoner, or even a demon, or an angel really matter? Is our discrimination necessary? Should we not strive for a world where everyone is treated equally, despite their class or species? You're really strange. But, if you're gonna make the netherworld a better place, I want to help you do it. I promise to make the netherworld a better place to live. Was that a part of my memory? Why? I haven't gotten my memories back from Medeiros yet. Did some of my memories stay with me? It feels like I'm forgetting something important. Miss Edna! Ah! Don't shout so close to me! We're surrounded by enemies! Be careful!
<laughs> Fools! Did you really think I would fight fair and square? All I have to do is find that fire sky and steal the demon tome! After I become overlord, I will destroy Edna! <laughs> That voice! I finally found you! What? The duel is not until tomorrow! Did you really think I'd wait that long? Ah! You dirty little... demon! Oh! I love it when you call me that! It really is the greatest compliment! Miss Edna, are you sure you want to anger him now? It's too late! Edna, you will regret this! Miss Edna, he's going to destroy your memory? Go ahead. Why don't you do it already? What? <laughs> you won't be so cocky after this. Your memory... Uh, it, it's gone! I thought you were going to make me regret something. <laughs> no! Where did it go? Master Edna, we got your memory back like you told us to, dude! Good work, Dark Durians! You! You betrayed me! Hey! We're demons, dude! Would you expect any less? Looks like the tide has turned. Would you like your death sunny side up, or will it be scrambled? You won't make it out of here alive! Witness my power!
<laughs> Please, forgive me. Now, what should I do to you first? Please, spare my life. Please. <laughs> Pathetic. I should never have relied on a demon to do an archangel's work. What? Who are you? <laughs> Filthy demon! You are not worthy of hearing my name! Master Volcanus! Why are you here? Who's this loser? He's the Archangel Volcanus! He is the supreme commander of the Celestial Hosts! What? Why are you doing this? An angel? Well, he looks like a bad guy to me. Ha! What are you talking about? You demons are the source of all evil! I am punishing you demons for the sake of world peace. If only that old man would listen to me! That is why I must become the Seraph and destroy all demons. How can you say all demons are evil? If our Lord heard that, he would be deeply saddened. Lord, How dare you talk back to me like that? It's all your fault! If only you had been eliminated, everything would have gone according to plan! I even disguised myself as God to deceive you, but you still survived! You were God? You tricked me! You lied to me more than any demon I've met! <laughs> If I defeat you and Edna, and then take the Overlord's corpse back with me to Celestia, I am sure to become the Seraph! Flan, for the peace of the world, you must die here. What a dork! Don't compare me to demons! <laughs> I don't care if you are an Archangel! I've had enough of your mouth! You're no different than Medeiros, tricking impressionable girls just to gain a title. Oh, shut up, you demon! I don't care what you are. I just wanted Medeiros to suffer utter misery for dragging me into this mess. But you killed him, so now what am I supposed to do for fun? You're gonna pay big time for that, chump! You're blaming me for this? Yep. How about you kneel down and beg me for your life? Oh, and apologize to Flan, too. Miss Edna! <laughs> Don't be silly. Do you? An ordinary demon girl truly believe you can defeat me? Challenge me if you wish to die. I will show you the power of the next seraph.
He did not escape. Instead, he shall suffer the wrath of the Seraph. How do you do, Mademoiselle? Appearing after it's all over? I bet you were hiding somewhere watching from a safe distance. Oh, so harsh. You are about to regain your memories. You can at least thank moi for that. I didn't need them. They're not even worth one hell. But I guess they really will return. How are you doing, Miss Edna? Do you remember anything? Hmm, not sure. But I think I'll remember in time. You don't look too happy. I am. But... But... There's more sorrow than happiness. That's because you haven't fulfilled your promise. Promise? What are you talking about? You have regained your memories. You should remember by now. Miss Edna? Promise? Did you call for me, my lord? It's about my son, Laharl. Oh, that Brad. Oops! So, what about the prince? It's been a long time since I became the Overlord. I am old, and I don't know when I'll be defeated by another demon. He'll never be defeated. I'm just saying if. If I die, the Netherworld will be plunged into chaos once again. Many demons will come after Lahara to become the next Overlord. Etna, this is not an order, but a promise between you and me. Promise? If I die, will you please protect Lahara? And make sure Lahara becomes a great Overlord. did make a promise to the Overlord. I completely forgot. What was I doing? I killed the Prince! Hey, what is this? No, it can't be! Miss Etna? Get away! Don't look at me! I don't get it! Why am I crying? You're finally being true to yourself. You're regretting that you killed the Overlord's son, aren't you? Miss Edna, if you're sad, it's okay to cry. Would you like some assistance? Miss Edna? Sorry, 
But I'm not that weak. I won't say I'm not sad for killing the prince. But I can't go back. This is the way I chose to live. There's still something you can do. What is that? You can say a prayer for him. For his peace and eternal rest. What do you think? It's not much, but I guess I can do that. <laughs> What's so funny? Oh, I uh, apologize for disturbing you at such an emotional moment, but... Beautiful Mademoiselle, are you not forgetting something? Huh? Is he not, after all, the son of the mighty King Krzyzewskoy?
Oh man, I overslept! Huh? Where am I? There's no time to be tired! The Netherworld has gone to hell while you were sleeping! <laughs>